The morning Twin Tiers live look at our Mansfield sky cam there, sponsored by First Citizens Community Bank. And you can see a little haze, a little bit of low clouds there throughout the sky cam as we're looking at some rain and a little bit of freezing rain moving throughout the area. And it's already starting to mix with a little bit of wintry mix throughout portions of the area. It's going to be a very sloppy day on the roads out there. Take a look at first warning live radar and satellite. You can see a lot of the area shaded in the green, which is the rain, but you can see spots of pink and purple mixing in. That's the sleet freezing rain mixture moving throughout the areas. Temperatures hovering right around the freezing mark and even some snow showers came through earlier and they're already starting to make their way into northwestern portions or northeastern portions of the viewing area. Wider view, you can see very wide system that we're tracking throughout the day today, stretching all the way back out to the west. And it's going to continue to move through throughout the day today. And that freezing rain, rain to start off the morning that we're experiencing now, going to change over to a complete wintry mix throughout the afternoon hours, then changing over to snow tonight. Because of all of that, the National Weather Service has issued these winter alerts. Winter storm warnings to points off to our north, but as we take a closer inspection, you can see Tompkins County included in that winter storm warning, the rest of the southern tier and Bradford County under winter weather advisories and across Tioga and Potter County under a freezing rain advisory as well as a wind advisory across Potter and Tioga counties. Winds tonight and going into your Monday going to be gusting upwards of 40, even 50 miles an hour. So what can we expect as this system moves through? Let's take a look. It's a multi-phase system, as I mentioned, with a mixed bag of precipitation. Starting off as rain and freezing rain this morning, changing over to a wintry mix throughout the day today. That wintry mix late this afternoon and throughout the overnight hours will change over to snow showers. And accumulation is going to be very widespread throughout the area tonight and into the day tomorrow. Much of the northern tier and southern tier right around 1 to 3 inches. But as you head up towards the Finger Lakes and points to the north, looking at three to six, even more inches of snow. Wind gusts, like I mentioned, upwards of 50 miles an hour. Okay, let's take a look at one of our snowfall accumulation maps here. This one does the best job, I think, of pinpointing just about how much snowfall we'll get. I think much of the area is going to be right in that one to three range. Much of the northern tier is going to see more rain and a little bit of sleet mixture. That's going to keep the snowfall totals down across much of the northern tier. Southern tier, right around that one to three inches. But as you head off, to the north and east, you can see accumulations quickly increase with some portions of uh, northern New York picking up over a foot of snow by the time this is all said and done tomorrow. Like I mentioned, winds going to be very gusty today. Not so bad, but tonight that's when they're going to pick up with winds sustained upwards of 20, even 25 miles an hour and gusts upwards of 40, even 50 miles an hour throughout the overnight hours tonight and during your day on Monday. Currently, Rain and a little bit of freezing rain falling at the Elmira Corning Regional Airport. Temperatures in the mid 30s. Same goes for up in Ithaca. Temperature of 34 degrees. Winds out of the southeast at 9 miles an hour. Temperatures throughout the viewing area hovering right around that freezing mark. That's what's making it a little tricky out there with the rain, freezing rain mixture as it's falling throughout the area. And that's going to be the story throughout the morning hours. We're going to warm it up to that 5 degree guarantee of 38. Then throughout the overnight hours, that's when it's going to change over to some snow showers. And it's also going to be quite windy out there as well throughout the overnight and into your day on Monday with temperatures drastically cooler down into the low and mid 30s throughout much of the area. But then we warm it back up upper 30s for your Tuesday. Future track mapping it out, you can see Rain, freezing rain, wintry mix throughout the morning hours, changing over to all wintry mix. And then throughout the overnight hours, that's when we see the best chance for any accumulating snowfalls throughout the area. But like I mentioned, especially across the northern tier, accumulation is going to be lower. Southern tier, right around 1 to 3, and then points to the north and east. That's where we're going to see the heavier snowfall accumulations. Your forecast for today, 38, that 5 degree guarantee. Rain, freezing rain, changing over to a wintry mix. That wintry mix will change over to snow showers, winds gusting close to 40, even 50 miles an hour. Seven day forecast shows upper 30s going into Tuesday with sunshine returning. Some scattered snow showers midweek, nothing too major. And then some sunshine yet again, peeking through those clouds to end off the work we can head into next weekend. But definitely take it slow, especially later on today. Still a little bit, mainly rain out there right now. That's what we were mentioning when we were coming in. But then it's going to start to change over that wintry mix, so it's going to get nasty out there later today. It got very icy out there. Yeah, and then over to all snow later tonight. So right. definitely take it slow out there. Well, do. You as well. Thank you.